Yo, what up? It's your boy, and y'all already know, I got here, Call of Duty Black Ops 2 news. Uh, just a quick video, guys. By the way, if you haven't checked out my zombie trailer live reaction and thoughts, go click over there. And if you haven't checked out my uh, zombie trailer breakdown, click over there, or over there, <laughs> excuse me. Uh, other than that, let's get to this video. Alright, well, this past weekend... Uh, Black Ops 2, uh, you know, developers or whatever, they just released uh, two new screenshots of uh, two new Black Ops 2 multiplayer maps. One is called Express and one is called Overflow. And Express, I'll, I'll tell you, I'll show you a picture right here. Is Express takes place at a state-of-the-art train station. As you can tell, it looks very futuristic. It looks very, uh, like you can go get to places real quick. Tell me what you guys think. Ain't much to say. Yeah. All right. Tell me what you guys think. And we got Overflow. Overflow is set in a dusty marketplace somewhere in the Middle East. As you can tell, very dusty roads. Uh, a lot of people are comparing it to Newtown. So uh, there you go, maybe. But yeah, tell me what you guys think of that. But yeah, guys, just to recap all that, we got, out of these past months, ever since GamesCon and now, uh, October 1st, I believe, we got six new confirmed multiplayer um, Black Ops 2 maps. So we got, let me just re-enhance that for you guys. We got Turban, we got Cargo, we got Yemen, Aftermath, Express, and Overflow. Six new Black Ops 2 multiplayer maps. Bam. Also what they released today, uh, this weekend I should say, this past weekend, is uh, leaked for Black Ops 2 prestige emblems. And I'll show you a picture of those. Just standard emblems, as you can tell right there. Nothing huge. But, uh, you know, they're adding a little different, you know, maybe. Nothing has been confirmed as of right now as of... Uh, you know, as far as you get to level 50 and all that stuff. But yeah, guys, that's that. Tell me what you guys think of those uh, emblems right there. And another thing that has, uh, I don't know if it's been confirmed, but it's rumor around the Call of Duty community is that now for Black Ops 2 multiplayer, when you prestige, it's, uh, you know, you won't lose all your weapon level and attachments. That's what they're saying. It's a rumor right now, guys. So, yeah. Right now, just to recap that. When you prestige, you won't lose your weapon level and your attachments. So, once you get to level 50, you're like, man, I don't want to prestige, man. Because I'm going to lose all my guns and all that stuff. Oh, well, now you can because you'll still have the attachments to the gun. And you'll still have your weapon level, you know. 13, 14, whatever. You know, 3. There you go. You'll still have it. So I think that's tight because it will encourage people to uh, prestige more. You know what I mean? Because you don't want to lose that stuff. You know what I mean? Because, you know, it takes a lot of hard work. They revealed a, a list of it, all the attachments that's going to be in the uh, Black Ops 2. So I'll leave, that, <laughs> I'll leave that in the description below. Black Ops 2 uh, Zombies. The visual style, as you could tell in the trailer, was a lot borrowed from left for dead that's what uh the developers are saying so um tell me what you guys think of that i mean left for dead xbox 360 real popular zombie game but you know we don't need to buy all that stuff we need to be our own separate game you know what i'm saying but yeah guys hope you guys i informed you well just a quick quick video and um yeah hope you guys go check out all those videos other than that stay safe stay positive and uh see you on the next one you yeah.